queens welcome back to the channel let's go ahead and talk about this cute little $20 wig girl so you guys know there's a lot going on in the country right now and I am giving you ways that you can save money during this time girl the salon is closed and I know you still want to look fly so we're gonna do it together with this affordable wig series so today's wig costs only $21 I do have the link for it in the description it is the wig that I'm wearing now so let's go ahead and hop into it this unit is by sensational and this is an older wig sometimes I find that older wigs are the best hidden gems and they're also the cheapest okay so this is one of Sensationnel's bump wigs and I have it in the color champagne. So a bump wig is basically a wig with no parting space that you can just throw on and go. But when I tell you guys, when I put this wig on, I was a little bit afraid because I was looking kind of crazy. But the Lord helped me out, girl. Thank you, Jesus. And now we are looking fabulous. So this unit comes with a darker color on the side. I would say the side is maybe close to a 1B to a 2. And then right here in the middle area, it has a champagne ish color it's giving me kind of a vibe of the color 30 but the official color for this unit is champagne now I ended up using the product mousse that I use a lot in my wig reviews everything that I use is linked in the description you guys already know that so if you want to pick it up for yourself online you can buy it and have it delivered to you through Amazon but the mousse that I use I use it in this part where the champagne color is just to give it some type of body because at first girl it was looking pretty dry Okay, it was looking dry as a shuck, and I was nervous because I was like, I can't be walking around here with no dry hair. Like, uh-uh, girl, what's going on? But the mousse got it together, you guys, and from there, I went ahead and morphed the curls how I like them using a brush. Now, I started off using a comb, and that's kind of where that dry effect came. I was having a lot of shedding from this middle area, and it was just acting very weird. But when I added the mousse and I used the brush, that's when the magic of these curls started to happen. So, I definitely suggest that you do use a brush and try to use some type of product similar to the mousse that I used. Other than the shedding that I went through with the comb, I really didn't have any other issues with this wig. Of course, I didn't have really any tangling, just a few snags in the middle portion where most of the hair is. I did end up using my Style Factor um, gel on the sides just to lay it down a little bit, and it really gives it a sleek fresh cut look which I absolutely love now the cap size is I would say big head friendly but it is pretty snug I don't feel like this wig is going anywhere which is great because this is one of them wigs with only one little baby comb okay one little baby comb holding off for life so if you have a teeny 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 tiny head you might have some slippage issues but as for me you guys know I have a large head I'm in between 22 to 23 inches and that's actually considered large so I don't have any issues with this wig possibly slipping I always do this y'all I style and take my earrings off and then I forget to put them back on and I'll be up here looking crazy oh my gosh so you guys, the name of this wig is Sensational Mod Mohawk, and I'm going to go ahead and show you the stock card, and then I'm going to style it a couple of different ways with another hat from Amazon. Now, as y'all know, if you watched my last short wig review, which was about one day ago, I'm loving these hats. They're fashion hats from Amazon. I had them for a really long time, y'all, and I just didn't really bring them out. But now that it's getting into spring, I'm finding the time to be able to wear them, and they look so good. So this is the stock card for this unit. Again, this is an older unit. It. so as you could tell this is an older stock card model for sensational but this is what it looks like and this is the wig mod mohawk so since my outfit has like hints of pink and things like that you guys can see my makeup is giving off pink today i'm gonna actually take my tan hat again i have this in multiple colors i have red purple tan i think those are the other colors that i have and i'm looking up because i have them like on my wall but we're gonna take the tan one today and if you guys are interested again the link for that is in the description for you so we're gonna go ahead and place her how i like it and here we go you guys I love this even better with the hat I feel like the hat just gives it an extra kick and it also is a great accessory with my outfit so if you guys want to see the full outfit make sure you go and follow me on Instagram at Queen of Mindset you guys know I post all my wigs all my outfits and I tag the vendors that I bought them from so make sure you guys go and check them out because everything I'm wearing is affordable honey okay so you guys that is it for this video please make sure that you share this video so we can get it to as many queens all around the world that we can 
can, please make sure that you guys hit them comments and let me know what you think about this unit, especially paired with this hat. You guys know I love to hear from you. And the more we talk, the more we grow, the more we learn about each other. So make sure you guys hit those comments. I love y'all so much. Thank you for tuning in once again, and I'll see you later. Bye.